In this video, we're going to talk about the free trading software to pass your prop firm challenges. Yeah, the software is called Funded Trading AI and it's a completely free tool you will find on our website and we built it and let it build for our community and we're using it actually ourselves to pass funded trading challenges. So when you want to download it, you can just go to funded-trading.com. By the way, you will find a lot of valuable content here on our website, which you can hopefully gain a lot of value from. But if you just want to download the EA, just click on funded trading EA. And here you will go to that landing page. You will find the information about how it works. And here you can download the funded trading EA. So what need to be mentioned is that this EA is sponsored by eurobotrader.com. We ask them that if they can develop a trading software for funded trading, and actually they said, well, you can sponsor this for you if you mention our name on the website. So if you're interested in having a robo trading developer, so somebody then that can develop your trading strategy into an algorithm. So they then don't need to trade metal anymore. You can contact them. It's eurobotrader.com. Here you can contact them on the website. You can get an offer, contact them. And also uh, if you want to change anything on this EA, you can just go to them and I'll talk uh, to them. So let's assume that you already download the software. It's pretty simple. You just need to put in the name and the email and it will directly be sent into your email, right? So once you have downloaded that software, basically what you need to do is only open it. It's a zip file. So you need to double click it and unpack it. And then you will get actually three files. The one is the EX4 file, which is the expert advisor itself. The other one is the set file, which is the file for the settings. And here you have the documentation. It's a docs for uh, how to install it, how to use it, etc. Right. So what you do next is you copy these things. And basically you go to your broker, whatever broker you're using. And basically you're going to the files. And you open the data folder. And here you're going to MQL4. Once you have this open, also double click, going to experts, and then you copy and paste the funded trading EA here. I already did that, so you would need to do it for yourself. And also the presets, you are going to paste a set file here. So once you have that, you just go back and you click refresh. So the funded trading EA will appear here. So what you can do now is you can upload and set this thing to the charts. And just to explain you how it works, it's pretty simple. You're going to load and then you can load the funded trading EA set files here. So then you will have the settings of the kind of recommended settings you can use. You don't need to use obviously, uh, which works for the expert advisor. And First of all, we just want to go over the settings and what those settings actually mean, right? So first of all, you have the, uh, you have the money management. You can make the money management either in risk in overall, or you can make the risk in lots, right? So you can make it as true or as false. Here you have a multiplier of the risk. So just to explain you how about this software works is that it kind of putting on, <clears throat> putting on long and short positions and it kind of, you know, works the way around to increase the, uh, the long position, the volume of the long position and, uh, increases the volume of the short position basically. So it's kind of a hatching system, uh, which maneuvers the way around to have a very, very low, low drawdown, actually, you know, um, usually what you see on the internet is those Martingale grid system, which fail when the market is going to one direction. So let's say they, um, the market is going like, let me just draw this here. So let me just 
like let's say the market is going down and those systems they just buy 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 and for somehow the margin is not it is not enough and it actually has a margin call by the way the drawdown is pretty high so you will have problems with your prop firm because they most likely will allow only maybe five percent drawdown or whatever right so with this um with this expert advisor it's a little different because it's putting long positions and when it sees that the trend is actually changing it putting short positions so in the time the market is falling it already making profits it's still having some long positions open but it's uh, enabling to make profits all the way, also when the market is going down so that way you will have much 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 less drawdown and also you are able to actually make uh, make uh, profits in downside and as I said the drawdown is less less higher and overall this is a very very nice system it's, it's pretty complex it's not that easy to explain so I just try to um, try to explain the basics of it right but um, it's, it's pretty it's pretty uh, decent if you know how it works and if you know how to set it up right that's important to add here Okay, so we have the funded trading EA. So we have a multiplier and we have profit. Profit is profit per trade. So you can set up that you want to make a, a profit on a specific single position. So whenever you say, okay, I want to make 10 for a specific position, it will be closed automatically. Global profit means profit for the whole account. Pair global profit means Let's say you have like 10 positions open, long and short positions, and it's in profit for $10, it will close the position. Maximum loss is like basically the, the option to have a maximum drawdown per pair so that you can have like a maximum equity drawdown. So let's say you want to have like maximum 1% risk and you want to really have it as a down risk, then you can put this. Space pips, uh, this means like the distance between a new position. Also like space one pips, space two pips. So like that the distance for more position is actually widened, right? Um, this is only the comments for the, for the is this basically the settings for the comments? It's not that important. Here you have a time filter. And here, um, this is the entry based on SMA parabolic SCR and the CCI. This is basically like a trend filter. So you can enter uh, basically on the trend. Um, what you here can do is like you can suspend the trades so that the trades will be closed step by step. Um, this is something you can actually, you know, test around with, um, but it's not something it's necessary to do. So yeah, just go forward here. Um, what I really recommend you is because we cannot have like a setting for each prop firm, right? We cannot have a set file for each prop firm. I recommend really to use the strategy tester from the expert advisor of, of, of MT4, right? With that tool, you are able to actually test this thing out in the past. This is very important. You cannot just use this tool and, you know, buy a challenge and let it run and think this will work out like just by itself. All right. There's no, there's no guarantee that if you don't proper test it, that it will work out hundred percent. So you need to test it first. That's important, right? You cannot just blindly use anything, you know, you just need to know like most traders are actually failing with proper challenges. And the reason is of their emotions right? And uh, maybe a lack of strategy as well. But, you know, you're going here and you loading the preset files again. So you will go here again, mcol4, presets, and you put the fund trading A here. And what important is, is if you have like risk of two, which is already pretty high, it depending on the challenge you need to face. So you can also make this lower and have like a lower downside risks here, 
you can also make a higher global pair profit depending. This is something you need to gain a little bit experience from. So what I'm recommending is to use this from the 50 minute. You can also use it to higher time frames, but from 50 minute it works pretty nice. And we will make like a shorter time test so that it's not taking too much time. Let's use it from maybe 2021 at the start. We can also have visual mode so I can show you actually how it works in real life. And we can do it till today. And basically now we having, it's the modeling. Every tick is the most precise way to backtest the strategy. The symbol is basically the asset which gets traded. You can also use multiple assets, but it's a little bit complex to test. And basically we will, we will, uh, I will show you later how you can optimize the settings for the specific requirements you have. But first of all, let me just show you how this works. So this, what the strategy backtester does, it's collecting the data from the M1, from the M5, and from the M15. And now you see it, uh, it actually doing, showing like a dashboard, um, which is actually, um, you know, showing you the account balance, the equity, the free margin, the account margin, the open trades. Um, let me just put on like a different template to make it more pretty, right? All right, so it should be pretty readable now. And what we also have is the open trades, buy trades, sell trades, lots and trades, total trades today. And as I said, like we have a limit of 99 positions. We can obviously also just um, make this limit lower. It's depending on what you want. And also you will see the win rate of the whole system. You see the profit today, profit yesterday, profit all time, the payoff, the expectancy trade, so what do you expect to make per trade? You see the average volume traded, the average volume per trade and the maximum volume traded, right? So what you can do now is to get this thing going and you see that it open a long and a short position at the same time. And basically you might wonder why it's doing that, but it basically finding out where the, where the market's gonna go and then it's increasing um, increasing the position of the um, of the short side because it's seeing that it's going into the short uh, in, into the long into the long side actually right let me just make it a little bit higher so we need to go back to black I guess to see it in a better way should be fine now okay we're not seeing this here but doesn't matter and you see that because it had like a long position, it had short positions, it closed in profit. In small, it's a small profit, but also the drawdown was pretty, pretty low, right? It was only a few dollars of drawdown. Keep in mind, this is a $10,000 uh, $10, account, right? So we still don't see it very nicely. Let me just try a different background here. Okay, this should work better. Okay, perfect, perfect. So now you have seen like we had a, we had a decent amount of drawdown here. Um, as, as I said, like this, depending on your coal kind of risk profile, right? Um, this was a drawdown of, uh, I guess it was 6% or something like that. I didn't check it properly. Um, so as I said, we already working right now with, um, with 2% risk. So I definitely, uh, recommend to size down the risk if you have like a really tight drawdown rule 
for the prop firm. That's very important because that's the way you have problems, right? Because drawdown is something with this kind of strategies you will have, right? You also have, you draw on definitely something you have in every strategy, but um, you know, this, this can make very nice profits. You make like, you know, we already like up 1.5% now within a couple of days, but also keep in mind uh, of the uh, drawdown. So you would need to adjust the settings um, so you have less affection to the drawdown, right? So let me just show you now another setting. What you can do is you can use open price only. This uh, will make the backtest a little bit faster and it will actually allow you to um, actually test things out much, much faster than with the everything mode. It's less precise, but it's still pretty good uh, just to have an overview about the strategy. And um, I'm just testing it with low risk on the M15 timeframe on Australian dollar, US dollar in this case. And uh, yeah, basically we will see how it works. And um, basically uh, we'll, we'll show you what we can achieve. So we're pretty fast here. As you can see, it's much, much faster than the other thing. And you can see here the account balance and the equity. You see that the drawdown is pretty low in most of times. Obviously, um, you will always have phases where the drawdown is a little bit higher. So you need to adjust that and you need to see and check for your challenge what exact drawdown you're actually allowed to have. But being honest as well, the profit here, even with the settings of 0.15 risk, within a few months, you already made like 25%. So you can easily set down the risk of the algorithm, depending obviously on the profit target you have, to maybe have it like um, have it like on 1.1 maybe or 1.2. And obviously the drawdown will also be much lower, right? Just to be considering that. So the drawdown will be maybe a few pennies, right? Because obviously the profits is lower as well, but you see it's making 5%, 7% within a couple of days, right? So if you need only... 6% profit, it's, it's pretty, pretty easily to get, right? Uh, so even here, within, I don't know how much time it was, it, it was not even a month, we made like 10%, right? So actually, you can, you can even put on the settings on a risk of 0.1, and then you will, you will get a much less risky approach, all right? You see what I mean here? So this risk now, the drawdown is pretty, pretty low now. And even then, you know, the, the performance within a couple, of, a couple of days, it's still pretty nicely. So first of all, I'm recommending you to make a list of all the requirements you need to pass your funded trading challenge. After you did that, you can find the perfect settings based on those requirements. And if you need any adjustments for the Funded Trading Expert Advisor, then you can also contact your robotrader.com. They can help you to adjust the Expert Advisor. So I hope this video helps you, the content helps you. We want to make sure that the prop trading industry is a much more transparent place. And if you have any questions, you can also contact us in our Telegram group. Make sure to subscribe our YouTube channel and Let's get it done. I wish you all the best. Happy trading. Stay tuned. You're funded trading team.